Today we're here at AF Corsa uh, and we're going to share some tips and give some advice on installing cameras for your Freebox Video HD2. We usually recommend that you use camera one to show the view through the windscreen uh, and then camera two can be used in a variety of ways. Some people have it mounted so that you've got an internal view of the driver. Some people use it to have a view through the rear window, uh, but you can play around with a variety of options. When using roll cage mounts, uh, it's important to give a bit of slack to the back of the camera cable to prevent too much strain being put on the camera. So if you're using cable ties, just give a little bit of slack to the back of the camera. And then when you're tightening up the camera clamp, make sure it's not too tight. Just tight enough, uh, just nip it up, but don't go any tighter just to avoid any potential damage to the camera casing. We talked about being careful not to overly bend the cable at the back of the camera. That also applies in the general cable routing as well. So when you're routing the cables through the car, make sure you don't overly bend the cable at any point or kink it, as that can cause interference and block the signal from the camera to the main unit. You can use the preview app to adjust your cameras and make sure they're properly aligned. Adjust it to where you want the camera to sit. And then once you've got the camera nice and level and you've got a good picture, and tighten up the clamp. So now that I've set the camera alignment up correctly, I'm going to use the preview app to set the exposure window. Click on the top right corner, click set window, and I'm going to draw a box around the windscreen of the car. And after a few seconds, it will set the exposure for the uh, view through the windscreen so that I get a good view out and, and not too much overexposure. <laughs> 